What's going on ladies and gentlemen, today I got a video for you showing off my Madden Ultimate Team, just showing you what it looks like, um, 96 overall, um, it's going to get a bit better in the next couple days, and yeah, so let's get right to it, um, start a quarterback, Robert Griffin III, I did have a Joe Montana at one point, but I like this RG3 a lot better than Joe, he was a bit fumble prone, he was also made a glass, he got hit, he was out two, three plays, so I didn't really like him too much. Um, back up, Ben Roethlisberger, team of the year, I pulled him, and then he was only going for like 10k, so I thought, oh, why not keep him, it's not too bad. Um, and then Brandon Fields, obviously, the back. Uh, fullback, Vontae Leach, flashback, um, pulled him out of a bundle. Um, probably, as I heard he's the best fullback in the game except for the 99 Bruce Miller that just came out as a position hero so not too bad um, for running back we got team of the week Marshawn Lynch um, he's a bit of a stud for those who don't have him he's, he's quick not, I mean not break your break away quick but he's quick and everything else is crazy high trucking elusiveness is decent for someone like Marshawn Lynch. He does fumble sometimes, which is not okay, but you know, we'll see. I've almost got my Barry Sanders, and tomorrow the position here comes out for running back, so we'll see what happens then. And back up all oh, rookie Jeremy Hill, who he's quite good, I think. Um, he's quick. He's a uh, I mean, his trucking is pretty high for someone who's, I don't know, he doesn't seem like the kind of trucking kind of guy to me. When you watch him play in real life, he's a bit quicker and can move a bit better than what the game suggests, I think, but whatever. Um, at receiver, uh, we'll start here, I guess, in the slot, T.Y. Hilton, final edition. He's in my slot because he's not super tall, but he's incredibly quick. As you can see right here, he's fast, can move. Um, his release isn't fantastic, but everything else is quite good. For a slot receiver, he's great. Um, and back up for him, Team of the Week, Odell Beckham Jr., who will be gone when I'm finished with the Julio Jones set. So, um, he's to me, he's more of a slot player as well. Um, on the outside, Alshon Jeffrey, final edition. This dude's a monster. Um, one th I mean, he's obviously not super quick, but everything else is fantastic. Catch and traffic's pretty decent. His release is good, and the spectacular catch is pretty good as well. Um, his backup, all-rookie Sammy Watkins, who I like. I tend to like him more than a lot of people do. He's pretty elusive. Um, his catch and traffic's good. His speeds up there, um, everything else is just good, I mean, I, li I like him, I like how he plays, and my third receiver, Darius Hayward Bay, um, he seems a more of a slot kind of guy to me as well, but I, I mean, he's a bit taller, so I can put him on the outside, I don't really throw over the top with him, but, yeah, I mean, he's good enough, he's, he's, he's pretty quick, his release is better than T.Y.'s at least. So release isn't that great. Um, catching traffic's not that. Nothing here is that that great, but all around he's pretty good. Um, and his backup, Andre Johnson, 93 MVP, road to the playoffs. Um, I like this one. This is one of my favorite receivers. Not ultra quick, but he, his catching traffic's good, and he's he holds on to like everything. So I like him there. Um, tight end, 99 overall, Mike Ditka. Um, dude is an absolute monster, um, catching traffic 100 as you can see, he's incredibly quick for a tight end, um, catching traffic as I said, release is good, catching is good, everything is fantastic, and f his speed at tight end absolutely kills people. Um, back up, I have a Luke Wilson, rising star. You guys know about him. He's quick. He's decent. He's a good backup. And, yeah, I mean, that's all I can say. I got a Jason Witten, too. He's not 
in the lineup. 90 overall, Jason Whitney's pretty decent, though. Right tackle, Team of the Year, Steve Vollmer. Sebastian Vollmer, sorry, messed that up. Um, he's pretty decent. Um, I'd like to upgrade on him, actually. His pass, or his run blocking there isn't fantastic, um, but his pass blocking is good. People don't tend to get around him too, too much. Strength is up there. It's a good for now, but I counter. I do want to upgrade him a little bit. Um, I just pulled this one today. This is the card that actually brought me up to 96 overall. Um, Zach Martin, all rookie, as you can see. His pass blocks good. Um, strength is good. Everything you need is good here. Um, speed and agility. It's a bit quicker than most. Um, so, I mean, that's good. Run blocking is good. Everything's great at this guard, actually. Um, center, 99 overall, Mike Webster. This dude is a beast. The best center in the game. He's better than Kelsey. His run blocking is 100, as you can see. Pass block, 96. Um, strength, 97. He can hold off essentially everybody. So, he's a definite monster. Um, left guard can use an upgrade, sit and use my left guard until I'm doing this set actually, so hopefully we get the 99 version ahead at some point. He's in because his black pass block is 95, he's actually a good pass blocker, run block's not fantastic, everything else is kind of eh, but a good holding for now. And then left tackle, all rookie, Taylor the one. Um, his pass block's pretty decent. Uh, run block not fantastic, but his strength is up there, and that's good on the line. And then we can go to defense. We'll start in the middle. Uh, 90 overall, little Laley. I'm probably going to upgrade him with the Dantari Poe. Um, his tackling is good. His pursuit's good. He's more of a run block kind of guy. Um, strength is pretty nice. And... 92 Will Fork, who's an absolute beast. Um, as you can see, his strength 99, he gets out of everything. Block shed's great, and he's an absolute monster. Even if he's not starting or he's your second D tackle, he's absolutely worth it. He's an absolute beast. Um, right end, 96 overall, Jude Avion Clowney. Dude's awesome as well. He's quick. Um, his block shed's good enough, and his power moves quite good as well, and he can really get off and fly. Um, left end, Calais Campbell, Team of the Year edition. Um, I really like this one. He's not super quick, but his block shed's good, his finesse moves good, and he can really get off and move, um, or he can get off and rush the pass, or at least his tackling is good as well. You don't running to running through that gap. Campbell and Will Fork, it's is impossible, pretty much. Um, cornerback, we can start here. EJ Gaines, all rookie. He's in my slot because he's not super tall, five foot eleven, and he's not as good as obviously that Revis, but his zone coverage is good. Um, he's quick, and he's, I mean he's a good corner, frankly. Um, we'll go to this side. Ninety-five overall, Brent Grimes. I like him. He's uh. He's quick. His man coverage is pretty good. Zone coverage. Everything about this Brent Grimes is really great, except his tackling. Uh, he doesn't tackle really well, unfortunately for me. Um, Darrell Revis, Legends, um, 97 overall. This guy is all around great. He's only 5'11", but he's still a bit of a beast. Um, he's quick. Man coverage, zone coverage, fantastic. Everything is just great on this Revis except his height. And 93 overall Super Bowl Maxwell. I really like this card. That's why he's still a part of my team. Zone coverage is good. He's quick. He's tall. And everything I want in a corner, really. And we'll go into our linebacking core. Uh, left outside linebacker, James Harrison, Super Bowl. This card is a beast. Um... Uh, jeez, I mean, everything is up there. Nothing is at 100 or anything, really, but everything is 95. And I mean, everything important is about 93 and above. He doesn't 
doesn't drop back into coverage or anything. The speed's not fantastic, but he's rushing the passer most of the time, so it's all right. Um, middle linebacker, 99 overall, Patrick Willis. Dude's an absolute monster, as you can see by those stats. It is He is absolutely crazy. His block shit's up there. His pursuit's 99, tackling's 100. Strang yeah, strength 96. He's quick. His awareness is good. Play recognition is not as high as this Keekly, but that Keekly was crazy. The play recognition in 95 is still great. Um, and right outside linebacker Elvis Dumerville. I like him. I quite like him. He's um, he gets off the block pretty quick. His pursuit's good. Um, one thing I don't like about him is that his I guess his block shed's not fantastic, and he does drop in the coverage every once in a while, and that's a bit low, low. Um, and backups, as you saw, you saw the Luke Keekly middle linebacker. I tend to play with two middle linebackers, that's why he's still on my team. Um, he, I, everybody knows about Keekly. This man's a beast. He dives all over the place. He's making plays everywhere. He can catch. Everything's great. And this is one of my favorite cards in this game. And as a Giants fan, I hate to say that, but I do like this Bruce Carter card. He's quick. Um, his pursuit's good. His, his zone coverage is good, as you can see. But his tackling's good. He doesn't let anybody go. And he can actually rush the passer. And on special teams, he's good as well. And, yep. And then we'll go to my, to my secondary free safety, Glover Quinn. Um, this dude's a monster. He's quick. He's all over the field. Um, his zone coverage is great. He's an absolute beast for those that, for anyone who doesn't have him. And finally, a strong safety. I uh, dig bow, 99 overall position hero. This dude's a monster. Um, he's tall. He gets in on everything. He's quick enough to get all over the field. Tackling's pretty good. He's an absolute beast. And finally, specialist. Um, kick return, Deshaun Jackson. Uh, T.Y. Hilton's the backup. He's quick, um, elusive, so that's, uh, that's everything you want, pretty much. Um, third down back, Marshawn Lynch. Punter, Ryan Allen. Yep, kick power, kick accuracy up through the roof. Um, he's my kickoff specialist. A punter is actually Brandon Fields. Um, I like his accuracy. I think putting, I mean, I can use Ryan Allen. It doesn't really matter who I use. There's no real difference between those two players. Um, long snapper. And then my field goal kicker, Hoshka. He's got a, he's got a decent amount of power on him. Not fantastic but a decent amount and he's accurate which I'm looking for pretty much so yeah guys that's pretty much my team um, I'm gonna be a having Leo Jones soon and Barry Sanders I'll be done with him I need like 10 players like Max and yeah I'll be done with him soon so those two will be added pretty soon and then a new set came out today, the all rookie. The all rookie. You get a 99 Charles Woodson. You can put him anywhere you want. You can put free safety or a corner. And I haven't decided what I'm going to do yet. I have a bunch of these anyway. So this set will be done soon as well. But um, yeah, that's the end of this video. Subscribe. Um, Man 16, I'm going to do every set in the game that isn't random. So. No, if it so if this comes out, that doesn't count. But every set in the game that's achievable, gonna be done. So subscribe, guys. And I'll be doing more videos, bundle openings, things like that. So subscribe, and that's it.